A lot of women that have come to see me have experienced their problems for you know 10, 15 years, and they thought, ah, oh, there's nothing I can do about that. This is what I have to live with. I just want to let them know that you know incontinence is not a normal part of aging. Um, that is definitely something that is treatable and can be curable. There's actually lots of um, non-surgical and surgical options that are available. I would say before that the field became more prominent, a lot of women thought, ah, this is a normal part of aging. I've had bladder leakage or incontinence. I just have to stay at home and wear pads or diapers. That's all that I could do for it. There are specialists who are physical therapists that work with women if they want a non-surgical option. There's the um, surgery for um, bladder prolapse, the advance of laparoscopy, um, where we don't have to make a large incision in order to uh, perform surgeries. There's even Botox nowadays that can help with patients' bladder and bladder symptoms, um, besides the medications that people are aware about aware of. This field is more all about quality of life. It's about women who are living um, longer, but actually younger and healthier lives. 